Developing this morning, a man is dead after he was on the southeast side of Grand Rapids during a 4th of July celebration. The Grand Rapids Police Department continuing the investigation this morning. 13 on your side's Veronica Ortega is live in studio this morning. Veronica, what do we know about this situation? Emily J, according to Chief Eric Winstrom, there was a large group of people firing off fireworks when the shooting happened. He says that means detectives have dozens, if not hundreds of people they need to talk to in this investigation. Police say the shooting happened last night just before 1030 near the intersection of Sycamore Street and Jefferson Avenue. The adult man was pronounced dead on scene. Winstrom says there they are fairly certain that it was a gunshot wound that killed him. He says they are still trying to determine whether the gunfire was celebratory or if he was targeted. Unfortunately, there were many people, including children, on the street when it happened. So as the officers approached, literally there were kids so close that they became part of the, the crime scene. You see the tape here mm. uh, right behind me, and it was several blocks that we had to cordon off, and there were a lot of family members that we had to escort, including young ones, mm. away from where uh, forensic evidence was located. Winstrom added that the victim's loved ones tried to take him to the hospital, but that was unsuccessful. Investigators do believe the shooting took place outside and not in one of the nearby homes. Police say it is still very early in this investigation. There is no one in custody at this time, and the victim's name has not been released. Emily, investigators are still looking for more information from the community. If you know anything, you're asked to contact GRPD or Silent Observer. Veronica, thanks for that. And we are continuing to follow this story. Stick with us on air and on our website, also on our 13 plus app.